Hi guys, today we're going to look at the installation of SketchUp Pro on uh, your desktop in Windows, I believe 10 64-bit uh, version. Uh, the reason I caved in, I bought the SketchUp Pro for one year since I wasn't able to export it, uh, my foundation plan to my Trimble Business Center. I'm sure there is a trick, I'll look into that, however now time constrained me so I had to do it ASAP. And I figure I might as well run you through the installation. So once you purchase it, uh, you get 3 million emails and one of them is basically where you can download it. So I downloaded the desktop version. Uh, I went with the Pro just because I uh, wanted to have a desktop version. I believe there is few of them. When considering which one, uh, I used the free one for first few uh, learning exercises. I uh, looked at the shop, uh, it's web only. I was looking up more for a desktop version, so my next chance was to have a SketchUp Pro. So I went there and purchased it, uh, went through the whole shebang. Now I already have it downloaded in my computer and let's see how long it takes to um, install. So I'm double clicking right now the uh, installation package. Uh, there is a Windows pop-up, hey do you really want to install it? Yes. And let's see, so it's uh, doing its own thing here and uh, not sure what, where and why. I don't see nothing. Oh, yeah, there is still still loading. Not sure if I downloaded just a downloader or whatnot. Let's see. There is the SketchUp logo and it's uh, going through the motions. Oh, it looks uh, decently fast. Again, that would depend on your um, speed of the computer, memory and a whole bunch of stuff. Again, I have opened 300 million applications. That might take its toll. And since we are waiting, I just wanted to say, don't forget to subscribe, it would help me out. I'm trying to build it up up to 500, can have our community going on. So well, here we go, choose a language, I'm gonna choose English. Uh, yeah, uh, it's asking me the directory where I wanna do it, so I'll just do C drive, that's okay. And okay, SketchUp Pro 2022. So decent, decent speed, I'm already spared their bar halfway through, we are just, you know, like 2-3 minutes in. So let's see how we can get it going. Copying new files, so the standard installation packages uh, we've seen with the other softwares. Um, boom, operation complete and I can see already a whole bunch of uh, icons here, okay, ready to go, finish, let's go, here is some kind of layout, SketchUp Pro and Style Builder, I'm gonna go, actually I'll put the layout there, and just cleaning up my desktop, usually when I log in remotely all this goes to crap, so, uh, I agree, not like you have a choice. Let's hit continue and let's hope this will open. The other thing I want to do, okay, sign in, yeah. So obviously uh, it's gonna take me to my Trimble login and I have the two time verifications. Beautiful. You are signed into all things SketchUp. You can choose this app to continue using your SketchUp Pro apps. You can close this. Okay, so I can close it. Oh, look at this. And we are back here. We have some files here. There are no recent. Uh, okay. Uh, let's see if I can open a file here. Okay, so this is one of the file from my wonder how can I 
open or if I can open a file from from my Trimble SketchUp. So let me open simple one here and see and maybe I can import it from a Trimble um, cloud. Okay, so obviously I, at the first side we can see it looks differently. The dude is much nicer. Let's see. Uh, Trimble Connect, open a model. Okay, you see? Let's go open it. Uh, it should take me to my Trimble Connect and my SketchUp folder. And I have here our foundation. And it's downloading it. Boom, and this is our foundation we did with a different looking dude and voila that would be it yeah uh, hope you like it again don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you next one